finance has completely outpaced right, the real economy. And so this issue of rebalancing from you know, all this value extracted from financial intermediation to nurturing the real economy is a very hot topic, I think, on both sides of government. But I think what's often missed in this debate is realizing just how financialized the real economy is. So it's not about big bad hedge funds, derivatives, credit default swaps, and the great industry manufacturing real economy. It's also about reforming how this real economy is working because it's basically just as bad as the banks. We really have to start linking our accusations of rent seeking, of the speculators, or using Ed Miliband's word, predatory versus productive capital. So these critiques, if you want, that are about value extraction to a theory of value creation and the role that different actors play in that value creation process, including the state, and as we'll hear from Bill, not only. Just as a, had a challenge, if you want, to really not think about this just in terms of reforming finance, but reforming macro policy, innovation policy, finance policy, competition policy together, and what is the objective is growth that is smart, inclusive, and sustainable.